Canada is a parliamentary democracy. We elect members to represent us in our federal parliament and our provincial and territorial legislatures. In a parliamentary system, government is separated into three branches. There are many layers, with all of them working together to serve the people. Let's take a closer look at how it works at the provincial level in Ontario. First, there is the legislative branch, composed of all elected representatives. In Ontario, these elected individuals are called Members of Provincial Parliament, or MPPs for short. Each MPP represents a different geographic area within Ontario, called an electoral district or constituency, and most are associated with a political party. MPPs convene at the Legislative Assembly in Toronto. Here, MPPs debate issues, pass laws and legislation, approve finances, and examine government activity. Then, there is the Executive Branch, led by the Premier and the Executive Council or Cabinet. The Executive Council has to maintain the support of a majority of the MPPs in the Legislative Assembly in order to be able to govern the province. In most cases, the role of the Premier is given to the leader of the party who has the most elected MPPs in the Legislature. The Premier then chooses MPPs to be part of their Cabinet. The Cabinet Ministers are responsible for leading ministries, which deliver vital programs and services associated with one area of responsibility. The Executive Branch is responsible for developing policies, delivering programs, and implementing laws. Lastly, there's the Judicial Branch, which is a group of independent courts that act separately from the other two branches. It is their responsibility to interpret and enforce laws, to protect citizens and discipline offenders. So what matters is the provincial government responsible for? The provincial government makes decisions and provides services in many ways that impact your life on a daily basis, like education, healthcare, agriculture, energy, and the environment. They also handle other matters like driving and highways, culture, and tourism. By now, you should have a better idea of how the provincial government works. What's important to remember is that it all starts with you. Voting is your way to influence your government, your province, and your future.